Am I live? Give me a sec. Am I live? Computer. Computer. I think I am. Making sure. Because uh, something on my computer is kind of slow at the moment. So we'll see. All right, I think we're good. Welcome back to more Royals franchise today. We are playing the Denver Broncos up in Denver, coming off a week one blowout loss. Got destroyed by the Chargers. Destroyed. Luckily, you know, that might be just be some, maybe a little preseason, you know, play. But hopefully we can open up this week and get a win against Denver. Now, Denver, you know, they've, they've been an evolving team as this franchise has been going. But they've never been really good. He was good last year, but they really, like, you know, can fill all the pieces. You know, Russell Wilson's still there at 36 years old, with Jordan Travis as the backup. Javante Williams, Joe McLaughlin. They had Corlin Sutton, Jerry Judy still there, Marvin Mims, Nico Collins, Ronnie Bell, Greg Dolchich, Jake Brenningstall, Ernest Green, the third ever left tackle, Ben Powers. Josh Myers, why do you have three centers? Okay. Clint Myers, Mike McGlinchey. So overall, m mostly the same starring uh, line. Zach Allen's still there with Jermaine Johnson the second from the Jets. Got Mason Smith, uh, and not really too much else in the, the tackle room. Got Joey Weathers at left outside, Thomas Incombe, Drew Sanders, Ben Crisp. Jamil Barkley, Baron Browning, Nick Benito, Pat Sertan, uh, Davidson Igbenosin? I don't know how to pronounce that. Working from Ohio State. They have Bryce Hall, Ambry Thomas, Riley Moss, Maury Mathis, Justin Simmons over there still, Kane Stearns, Terrence Brooks. Kicker is Harrison Butker. Punter is Mitch Wisnowski. So they're kind of a, uh, Mismatch of new and old from what year one to year three. There a bit there a lot of mismatch. Some things are saying exactly the same thing's completely changed. Anyway, let's see if we got I forgot probably have to go over this last uh, time, but there were some trades, you know, we did. Forgot to go over it last time. So let's just go over it now. Oh by Wagner is now an eagle. Okay. Let's see, trades. Oh, so that's where Josh Myers came from. Who's trade for, the Steelers trade him for a six and a seven? That is a low bargain. Oh, and they also got a uh, Shimmer Turner. Okay, Let's see, uh, Buccaneers traded Yaya Diaby to the Eagles for Nakobe Dean, and then a fifth went to the Eagles. It's from twenty twenty seven. Uh, Saint trade Country Milton Commanders for Michael Carr the second and the seventh. Uh, Coltry Julius Brents, the commanders for Jatavius Morin and a seventh. Chiefs trade Leo Chanel to the Buccaneers for two sevenths. Oh, and uh, Javion Cohen. Ravens trade Isaiah Lickley to the Italians for a fifth and a seventh. And Makai Wingo went to the Ravens. Okay. And the Buccaneers trade Tanner Coisio to the Panthers to, for Brady Richardson and a sixth went to the Panthers. Now, our trades. Trade Byron Young to the Giants for a 6th and 7th. Trade O'Connell to the Patriots for a 7th. So there we go. We got some late round draft picks for two players who didn't, weren't really working out. Byron Young didn't really do anything with us. So, we sent him away. Now, our strategy for this game. Yeah, I think it's a safe uh, defensive strategy. Defending inside run with uh, Jonte Williams. No, I'm not scared of Blitzang. I'm not scared of Blitzang. I say... I want the run game, because they do not have... They have one good defensive tackle. If you can get, like, good blocking, we can go through them. That is not the weekly game goal. Holy hell. Um... I would say... Two passing touchdowns. 
Uh, oh yeah, Evans got his own goal. Let's see, his his our head coach goal would be. Hmm. Yeah, that's good for the defense there. Offense, offensive coordinator, our job would be at 200 yards. That's good. Well, I want to say 24 points or less for the defensive coordinator. Because last week didn't really give me that much hype for the defense. We'll still see how this week goes. Yeah, that's good. All right, send a drink. Come on, no injuries. So far, so good. So far, so good. We're good. Defense. Uh, linebackers are good. Cornerbacks look to be good. Safeties are good. We are set. All right. Upgrades. Zion Branch gets upgraded. Okay. There we go. 70 overall now. Who else gets upgrade? Tyler Hall. I'm up his slot. And then we have Nesta Jade. I'm up his run stopping. There we go. All right, let's check the injuries, like, for us in Denver. Or, honestly, let's look around the league. Let's see, the Ramsey on some injuries. Ravens got a couple. Uh, ooh, Jamal Adams out for 11 weeks with a fractured shoulder blade, but he's now in IR. Uh, let's take a look around the league. Uh, ooh, Jatavon Sanders, 13 weeks with the Bengals. And Jamar Chase for three more weeks with a broken collarbone. And DJ Reader. Bengals are going through it. Cardinals, just like just a round of multiple injuries. JC Jackson's hurt on the Chargers. Ryan Kelly, broken finger. Ooh, Jonathan Taylor, partial MCL tear. Uh, Eagles, uh, this tight end, Oscar Delps, out for six weeks. There's no, like, major, major injuries yet. Like, ooh, Hutchinson out for five weeks. That's going to hurt Detroit. I have to figure out who the hell this guy is. Is he even... Let me guess. Okay, I know exactly who he is. Shiloh. That is Shiloh. Why are you censored? I believe that's how you spell his name. Let me Google this. Yeah, because Colorado safety, Sanders, come on now. Shiloh. Oh, no. No H. Really? Really? S-H-I-L-O is a censored. Really? You know, I'll just keep the H there. Come on, man. That's just sad. Fix your damn centering system, man. <laughs> All right, there we go. Injuries have been looked at. Everything's checked off. We should be good to go. All right, uniforms for the Saints. I don't believe this is a primetime game. All right. Here we go. Denver Broncos over at Power Field at Mile High. Back-to-back -back road games for us this season. Cortland Sun still looks like he's good as good as always. All right, here we go. I did fix the issue with uh, Crosby lying up in the center. I did fix that. I just put I made sure Tyree was there on some plays and rotate in Malcolm Coons like to do in real life. So. All right, on the return, gets it to about the 20, 25. I was misreading. Okay, out comes Russell Wilson, possibly his swan song season. <clears throat> My voice is already dying on me. Oh, he had a horrible week one. 
Took some tea, hot drink. Took a sip of some hot tea. Should be all right. Russell Wilson, handoff. Gets four. Javante Williams gets a, gets a decent game. Seriously, my voice is already fucking dying on me. Holy shit. <clears throat> Second six. Russ, hands off. It's two there for Williams. Third and four. We can get a possible three now on the first drive. Come on, boys. Russell Wilson drops back. No pressure at all. Those wide open tight end. First down for the eight yard game. Jake Brenningstall gets it. Russell Wilson drops back. Those same throws behind the Dolchich, and this time it gets six. Second and four. Russ drops back. Those wide open Marvin Mims. Or oh, is that Sun? That's Sun. Okay. That was Mims. Thought that was a nine on the back. Thought that was Mims. 16 yard gain. They enter our territory to 39. Come on, guys. Wilson dropping back, getting some pressure. Sack to Vondry Sweat. Brings him down after 11 yard loss. Back to the 50 yard line. Took him right out of field goal range for that one. Second 21. Wilson drops him back. Gets some pressure. He has a through complete, but dropped. Looking for Williams on the sideline, but that would have been a loss anyway because of Merrick. That would have got maybe two yards at best. Third and 22. Just going to run back, draw it, and that's going to go down at the 46. Now what are they going to do here? They're going to play away, as expected. It's a good stand there, thanks to the Vondre Sweat sack. Which now he sends it away. It's going to go out of bounds at the 12. Not a bad punt. Come on, Sanders. Yeah, he did not have a good week one either. So hoping he can have a bounce back week. Okay, first and ten at the twelve yard line. Well, give it to Algier on the first play. He has a good run here. Gets the first down and then some to the 24. 12 yard run. First and 10. Shadur dropping back for the first time today. Thuz has a man caught for five yards to Michael Mayer. Second five at the 29 now. Shadur drops back. Looking around. It was a check down to the Algier for a first down. Five yards there. And at the 35 yard line. There's a flag. Somebody jumped. That was on us. We're cha cha back. Michael Mayer gets caught for jumping. First, that took away his catch pretty much. First and 15 out to 30. The Algier we go. He has a good run. He has an amazing run. Guys, Ford gets the first down. Algier is shining early. And at the 45 yard line. First and 10. Shadur. Those on the run. Gets it to Zamir White. Gets. Dodges a tackle and gets a first down to the 44. Good job, Zamir White. Empty set formation here. Three, two Shadur's left. Shadur, short throw over to Michael Mayer. By four, gets about six. Now at the 38 yard line. Offense is improving early from last week. At least that's what it's showing at the moment. Shadur. Foos misses his man to a wide open Michael Mayer. Missed him completely. 
third and four. Should have had Algier, honestly, if you want to do that throw. Maybe it was a good throw, but a good read. And Shadur's accuracy issues are, st are showing up again. I have to take a field goal. Two wide open guys, he just misses them. Field goal is good. We're up 3 0. Now that these accuracy issues consist throughout the season, we might be looking at a new QB for next season. Because these accuracy issues are a problem. Okay, Wilson now at the 25 yard line. Dropping back. Those incomplete misses till the end. Chris Smith was in coverage. Second and 10. Heavy formation here from Denver. I see two tight ends out there. They're going to run it, and they don't have the blocks. Robert Spillane on the tackle. No gainer. Third and 10. Wilson going from pressure. Rolling out, throws, on the, throws away, incomplete, and that's a three and out. Defense with a good stand there. We're going to return it at a good field position. Gets to about the 42, 43. This is 42. I'll take it. I'll take it. All right. Handoff. Algier has some decent blocks. It's about four there. All right, Shadur. Got some pressure. Throws to the side. Complete first down to Tory Horton. They say no? Hold up. Hold up. No. I think he caught that. Look. Ah. Uh, it's like his toe is slightly... Oh, his toe is slightly like off the ground. I think that's worth a challenge, though. I think it's worth it. Uh, this is like literally a toe. It's like the whole thing here. Do you have possession when the toe hit? That's what the refs say. They say no. Yeah, it was like judging by a toe. His big toe touched the ground. That's what the whole thing was. Shadur checks it down. First down anyway. Jacoby Myers gets it. Alright, still 3 nothing heading into the second quarter now. First time at the Broncos 45. Going to play action here. Short throw to Michael Merrick gets 8. I know that there was less throws to Irv Smith than there were last week at least. Second and 2, play action. We're not going to have any blocks and that's going to be a sack. Lost that A from Caden Stearns on the safety blitz. Third and ten. Back to where we started at the 45. Shadur throws. Hits the crew lines for a first down to the 28. Good throw from Shadur. Like, I'm not even blaming him on that uh, sack. He just had no blocks. Going to hit open man, touchdown Raiders, Zamir White on the receiving catch. Let's go. Let's go. All right, we're looking better than we did last week. K 
Kicks up and it's good. We're up 10 to nothing. All right. Broncos get the ball at the one. They're going to have to bring it out. Get past the 10. Do they get past the 20? They get right at the 20, in my opinion. They say 21. Out comes Russell Wilson again. They're going to hand off down the middle, and that's going to pick about three to four. They say three. Second and seven, 23 yard line. Wilson drops back, he's going to have to run himself, and he's not going to get anything. Loss of three. Tyree Wilson on the tackle for loss. Third and ten. Russ throws open tight end. There's a flag on the play. Let's see what that's about. Holding on the offense, that's going backwards. Take away that good catch from uh, Dolchich. Empty set formation for Denver. Third and 20 at the 10 yard line. They need a big play here. Wilson's going to feel some pressure. He's going he's to fumble it. And it's recovered by the Broncos alignment at the 1 yard line. And there's an injury to Russell Wilson, too. That means Jordan Travis will be checking in if Russell Wilson can't make it to the next drive. Fourth and third, you got a punt inside their own end zone. That's not going to be a good punt because the horrible, horrible position. And Horton gets it over to the 37. Okay, we'll see what uh, Shadur can do here. We're, we can get points right now. We just got to get closer. Algier gets the ball first. He's, he's going to have his worst run of the day. Lose, gets one, and Irv Smith goes down with the injury. So he'll be heading over to the side, locker rooms. Shit. And Ms. Harrison Bryant will check in at tight end, too. Second and nine. And that's going to go nowhere, but he shakes him off and picks up seven. Now Parham goes down with the injury. Bryce Falls will be checking in over at center now. Injuries on the pile up for both teams. Third and three. Shadur. Gonna roll out those on the run. Incomplete. Look at Jacob Myers. Fourth and three. And we'll kick a field goal, make it a 13 to nothing game, hopefully. 47 yarder, 47 and a half. That's good. 13 nothing. Raiders. All right. Oh, yeah, I do have an announcement that I'll be talking about at halftime, so stay tuned for that. All right, get to the 22. Out comes Jordan Travis now in charge of the Broncos offense. The Florida State quarterback. Going to go play action on his first play, going deep. He's going to take a shot, and it's incomplete. Almost caught, though. Just good defense from uh, Hobbs and Merrick. Second and ten. Travis. Travis drops back. He's getting some pressure. He's gonna roll. He's gonna find a space. He's gonna throw caught first down over the Marvin Mims. 13 yard catch and Mims' first catch of the day. First and ten. Travis. Drops back, no pressure at all. Finds Elaine, incomplete hits the dirt, and Quinn Myers goes down to injury. Second and ten now. We're going to blitz for the safety, and that turns out to be a good call as Malcolm Coons comes up the tackle thanks to Merrick, and there's an injury to Williams, too. Injuries are piling up for Denver in the past couple plays. Travis going to empty cell on third and 11. Raiders bring a lot of pressure. That's going to be a screen pass over to McLaughlin. 
And that's going to get to fourth and seven, four yards there at the end of the day. Wisniewski sends it. We won't get at the 19. Going to bring out past the 20. Gets it past two about the 25. Fights forward to the 26. Now comes the offense again here. Shadera throws. And that's going to be almost picked off. Very close being coming to pick. Very close. Second and ten. Shadero getting some pressure. Throws it away. There's a flag on the play. That's going to be a roughing the passer call. Roughing pass on Baron Browning. And that's a 15 yard first down penalty to the 41. First and 10 at the 41. Hand off to Algier. Doesn't have that many blocks. Gets nothing. All right, second and 10. Chadur threw short over to uh, Michael Mayer. Gain of five, third and five. Come on, boys. Play action, Chadur gets some pressure. It's gonna roll out to the side, find space, goes, misses his man. It was open till. That'll be our punt here, fourth and five. AJ Cole sends it away. That's gonna take a little bit of a slant, go out of bounds over at the 18 yard line. Come on, guys. All right, Travis dropping back. Malcolm Coots come in, throws it away and complete. Let's check a look on Russell Wilson. Like, is he done done for the game? Let's take a look. Because we have a lot of injuries we got to kind of look over. For us, Irv Smith's out for the game and Parham's out for the game. For Denver, he's out for a quarter and Russell Wilson's out for two quarters. He'll be back probably late in the game. Travis dropping back, looking around. Those complete, but Chris Smith brings it down to a four-yard game. Good coverage there from Chris Smith. Third and six. Pressure hits a through, but still complete first down. Now Quinn Myers goes down again with another injury. First and ten now for Denver. Wilson, wide open, Jerry Judy for his first catch of the day. Just wrapped up at the 46-yard line. Two-minute warning, an empty set now for Denver. Travis getting some pressure. He's going to take it himself. It slides at the 33. 13-yard run from Travis. First and 10 out the 33-yard line. Travis, high snap, hands it off. The Abu takes him on, takes tackles him for a seven-yard gain. Second and three. Travis now, second and three, clock ticking. Travis goes over the side, the wide open Dolchich is brought down by Tyler Hall and Jacobian Bennett at 12. Wilson throws another wide open catch. Touchdown. Marvin Mims Jr. touchdown. And only 15 seconds left on the clock. That was masterfully played by the tight end, by the quarterback. I said tight end, whatever. Quarterback. That was, that was masterfully played. No time left to really do anything and got a touchdown. And no timeouts used, too. 
four, and on the return, gets it to about the 24. See if we're just running and taking a half time, or what we will do here. 11 seconds on the clock. We're just going to hand it off to Algier, who's going to have a decent run. And that's going to get to the, uh, 36. Time, maybe just a timeout. Five seconds on the clock. Shadur going to drop back. He's going to throw it in just... Oh, that was caught at one second on the clock. Okay. What are we going to do here? What are we going to do here? We're going to chuck it. No, we're just going to go short throw. Complete. Out of bounds. I thought we were just going to chuck it downfield and see what happens. All right, 13-7 is your score at halftime. Oh, yeah, announcement. So, as this is preparing, I I have multiple unfinished games here on the channel that I've streamed, right? Now, I think I'm going to try and start finishing them this, this month. I'm going to try and get back on a full schedule every day. Attempt. I'm going to try. So, we'll see what happens, right? Maybe even do two streams a day at night. We'll see. But, yeah, that's the plan for now. We'll see what happens. Anyway, now we're taking over the 25-yard line. Hand off. Alger gets swarmed pretty fast. No gain there. But yeah, that's a plan. Just get some unfinished games to be finished. All right. Raiders. Hand off. Alger gets nothing there. The tuning into the run game. I think I'm gonna drop back here. They stacked the hell out of the box still. They were ready. Shadur throws downfield. Has a man open. Tory Horton gets over to the 30 yard line on the Broncos side of the field. Holy shit. Giant gain there by Tory Horton. Shadur throws again. This time it's ricocheted away. Look for Myers. That was defended by number one there. Guy who almost had the pick earlier. Second, 10 over at the 30 now. Shadur dropping back. Throws outside to Tyler Algier. Shakes a man off, playing forward, gets a bingy and six. Good run in there. All right, third and four. Well, fake to Algier. Short throw is incomplete. Look from Myers. That was the defended. Grow. Fourth and four, we're going to make this a two-score game with a 41-yard kick. It's up. It's good. Two-score game. All right. Denver now. They're going to take an end zone. They're going to take a knee. That goes to a 25. Audible called. Travis still in. Going to roll out. Throws on the run. Caught. And that's going to get four yards there. Havandre Sweat goes out with the injury. Shit. Second and six now. Hand off. And, ooh, he got hit hard. Williams. He's back in. Gets three. Third and three. And that's going to be a big game there from Williams. Merrigan Branch bringing him down at the 48. The safety duo. All right, first and ten. Hand off. And he's going to brought down after a five-yard gain by Crosby. Sadly, Mad Max has been kind of quiet today. He's not even out there on the field right now. That's how quiet he's been. There we go. First down. 
Come on, guys. Gotta get a stop. Please. Hand off, and Mad Max just chases him down. He's tired of not getting his tackles. That was a good chase by Max Crosby. No gainer. Second and 10 to 40. Travis throws short. And Max Crosby again on the tackle. He is hungry right now. Three yard gain there. Third and seven from Nico Collins. Travis calling the audible. Mim is moving inside. Travis throws, misses the wide open man incomplete. They're going to try and kick a field goal here. This will be a 53 yard attempt here from Harrison Bucker. Former Chief is good. Malik Ray goes on injury. Of course he does. Six point game now. We need points to make it a two score game here. Want to take an engine that goes to 25. Come on, guys. Hand off. Algier trying to get forward. Can't get much. Gets one. That was tackled, was tackled by Crisp. Second and nine. They're trying to hard count him. Short throw is complete to Toy Hoy, and that's the first down to the 40. Good catch and run there. I'll take it. All right. First and 10. Shadur. Booze. Incomplete. Look at Jacoby Myers. Couldn't get it to him. Coverage was too good on him. Second and 10. Hand out to Algier. Going to go down the middle. Gets four. I think Algier is getting a little. Uh, the defense getting used to him. So let's just switch him out a little bit here. Your defense is starting to get used to him a little bit. Never a good thing. We have Zamir White take some snaps. Third and six. Shadur drops back. Look around. Going to take it himself. That's a first down run. Gets 11 down on the run. We're sitting now at the 45. Shadur, feel some pressure going so deep. Tried looking for John Metchie the first time today, but could not come down with it because of uh, Patrick Tan, the second. The best, one of the best corners in the league. Good defense there. Second and 10 now. Shadur getting pressure. That's going to pounce all 56 on the Broncos, and that's incomplete. Offense stalling. And that's going to go to sack. There's a fumble. And we recover it, thank God. But it's 4th and 21. And we got a punt. AJ Cole sends it away. Then we'll take out their own 10. They're going to bring it. it won't get much because it's also up to 19. All right. Travis still there. I'll run it and the end the quarter after a, a nine yard run to eight. And I'll end the third quarter We're up set by six points. We'll see if uh, Russell Wilson comes back in. No, Travis is still out there. They're going, oh, Diablo reads it well on the blitz. That's a sack loss of six. Third and eight now. 
Good read by Divine Diablo. Bose caught. First down over by who, uh, who's number 12? Nico Collins. Okay. That's Collins. I thought it was. First and 10 now for Denver. Well, rough. There's a bull rush to the line. Javante Williams finds the gap to the 40, 35, brought down at about the 32, they say. That was a risky play call on defense and it did not work out. Handoff. And that's going to go to a two yard game. All right, Travis, second eight at the 30. They're moving downfield. Travis throws on the run, gets it to his man, caught for a gain of three at the end of the day. Tyler Hall in the tackle. Third and five. First half was all Raiders. Second half so far is all Broncos. Hand off. And there's a flag on the play. Let's see what that's about. Holding on the offense. Now they decline for a fourth and one, except for a third and 13. We accept for a third and 13. They throw deep and incomplete. First down over to Marvin Mims who gets injured on the play. That goes to the 11 yard line. I personally probably would have declined for the fourth and one. Travis, got some pressure throughs complete. That's a touchdown to Nico Collins. And Denver now will be taking the lead from us. We need offense to wake up for this drive here and get us the win. We're going to take an end zone that goes to a 25. Need to wake the hell up. First and ten. Hand off to Algier. It's seven. Second and three now at 32. Shadur goes short to Michael Mayer. First down to the tight end to the 41. All right, first and 10, 528 on the clock and counting. Hand off, and I think it's sworn pretty immediately. No gainer. It's maybe a half a yard. Second and 10. Back to Algier we go, and this time he has blocks. Picks up 10, but it's third and inches, so not enough for the first down. At the 49, the Broncos side of the field, 30 inches. Play, play action. Shadur going deep, picked off. Caden Stern gets a 35 yard line. Now your defense to step up here. And Russell Wilson's back in. Play action from Russ, throws Dolchert's first down. Brought down by. Uh, they have at 46. So Russell Wilson's back in now. See that dynamic changes. Wilson throwing. Short throw is complete for a four yard gainer to Marvin Mims. Tacked out by Tyler Hall at the 43. Second and six. All right, Broncos using the clock to their advantage. They're gonna run. They're gonna run far. Brian Branch able to bring them down at the eight. We'll go to a two-man warning, and we need a defensive stand right here, right now. We need an amazing defensive stand.
Down the middle they go, and that is perfectly tackled. Second goal, and we use a timeout. Heavy set formation from Denver here. Same play, same result. Only two times two yard gain though. Third and end goal. Second time I used from the Raiders. Russell Wilson rolls out, throws on the run, throws the end zone, tipped up, incomplete. Jacoby Bank gets him down. And that will stop the clock, which is a good thing for the Raiders not to use that last time out. Denver kicking a chip shot field goal here of about 23 yards. Up, oh, it's good. So, touch, we need a touchdown to win it all here, ladies and gentlemen. One timeout, 149 on the clock. 147 on the clock. That's going to kick at the one, so good kick there from Denver. Make us use more time on the clock. Get to the 20. 143 on the clock, one timeout, see if Shadur has the clutch gene. It's a Michael Mayer who's able to get out of bounds. No, they said clock's ticking. They didn't get tackled in bounds, I guess. Okay. First down to 31. Shadur. The bad away incomplete. That'll stop the clock at 121. Second and 10 at the 31 yard line. Shadur dropping back again. Feels some pressure. Has to throw to Algier on the sideline. He goes out of bounds after a four-yard gain. Third and six. 116 on the clock. Shadur. All day. Goes deep. Has a man. Oh my god. John Mechie. Touchdown Raiders. Holy shit. Now, time on the clock is a worry because Denver still has all three timeouts and one or seven on the clock currently. But they will need a field goal to tie, touchdown to win for Denver. Jadur with a hell of a throw there. Denver going to take out on a return. Not a good decision that day. They lose three yards overall because of it. All right. Defense. Nia Stan here. 104 on the clock. Denver saw all three timeouts. Here we go. Russ threw short. Tackled. The eye out of bounds, I guess. No, they didn't. Clock ticking. Down the middle, caught Dolchich, big gainer. And right then he's the first time out for the, 42, the 47. 42 left on the clock. They're going to hand it off, and that's a good decision, honestly. And Denver uses their next time out. Now at the 43-yard line. One good pass puts him in field goal position. Russ, those complete Williams, first down. They're in field goal range. They can drain the clock and wait for kick if they want to. But they're going to go all out, all out uh, set here. See what happens. Russ throwing deep to the end zone. Trying to get it all and throws out of bounds in complete. 14 seconds left on the clock. Denver still has one timeout. They're going to hand it off here. And that's going to tackle inbounds. At the, and then we're going to use the last timeout to try a field goal here. There we go. Clock is stopped. It's going to be trying a 45-yard attempt to tie the game and go to overtime. And we tried to ice them with using our last timeout, so no timeouts left for this quarter. We should go ice them, like, you know, how it works in real life, where they kick it and see if they might make it or miss. I wish that they could program that, but EA's lazy. Kick is up. It's good. We're probably go we're going over time, boys. Unless we get a fuel uh, kick return here, we're going over time. All right, we have a chance to return it. Horden. He ain't going to get it, and that's going to go to OT. Twenty-three, twenty-three is your current score.
coin toss. We win the coin toss, and that means we will begin the ball first. I like how Jordan Travis is out here when y'all know it's going to be Russ. Okay, y'all know how field goal, how every time goal, uh, works. Touchdown, ends the game, field goal, get, lets the Denver have another possession. We're going to take a knee, and that goes to the 25. We're going to run it, and I'll just want no block and loses two. Oh my god, that was horrible. They, they rushed the line, and we could not defend. Shadur drops back. There's the Aljo on the outside. He's not going to get much. Get, no, they lose one. In fact, third and 13. Not a good drive. If we don't convert the first down here, we enter sudden death. We all know what that means. Third and 13. Well, right back draw. It was a Neil White. Gets six. Fourth and seven. We got a punt. Oh, no. Now I'm scared. I am scared now. I want fair catch at 22. That was a horrible like play calls and throws and Shadur. We relied too much on Algier there on that last drive. All right, Wilson. We're gonna roll it out. Those short has a man running stool. He's gonna get swarmed immediately. I think we're getting a one. And Malcolm Coots now gets injured. Fuck. Second eight. Wilson gets some pressure. Throws very deep. Has a man caught. Bennett could not cover. First and ten. Handoff. Hard hit there. Second eight. We need a stand of all stands here, ladies and gents. Wilson drops back. Get some pressure hit as he threw in. There's a flag on the play. We'll see what that's about. No. Get, get the fuck out of here. No. No. Hold up. Look. What What is Max Crosby going to do here? What do you want him to do? And look, he did. He barely fucking touched him. Hold up. No. Okay. I get it, but he was already on top of him. What do you want him to do? Fuck. Well, sent those a wide open tight end. All the room in the world. We had, we had a turnover, some. Five yard gain there from Denver running back. Williams. All right, second and five. Come on, guys. Get like a fumble, or get a pick. Yes! I called it! Tyler Hall returning to the third, 40. 50, 45, 45, 30, two, pick six, baby, 15, 10, five, touchdown, Tyler Hall house call. Let's go. Let's go, Tyler Hall. I called it. He was looking with Jerry Judy, and Tyler Hall read it perfectly. That's a win for us. Walk off pick six. Title Hall's house call. I love it. 29-23. Alright. So. 
Offense, still a bit of an issue. Had a good first half, not a good second half at all. Like, that was really not a good second half. Alright, can't see the score anywhere from here. Perfect. Tyler Hall deserves a thumbnail after that. He deserves it. Wow. Tyler Hall's house call. And then one just went to Alpha Four to Torn Lady from. Great. Oh, we have two injuries, uh oh. Yeah, two injuries to the D-line, Koontz and Sweat. Yikes. So D-line's going to be taking a little bit of a hit. All right, let's send to next week. Well, it sounds like the uh, pump in our house is going. It is raining. We have a trade offer for Irv Smith. What's the offers? Titans offering Hassan Haskins at a fifth, Bozeman at a sixth, uh, McCallan Castles at a fifth and a sixth, and Mason Cole for a fifth. Hmm. I'm really need a center, so I'm not like really, I'm not interested in Panthers or the Buccaneers offer. Haskins, I don't really need them, but, but hmm. Two picks still for a 2027th and a 2026. Mm. Less talent, but we get picks. I don't think it's going to all in here for us. Irv Smith, you are now a Green Bay Packer. There we go. There's the trade, everybody. McCallan Castles is now a Raider and Irv Smith now a Packer. Here's our new tight end. We're at number 89 currently. Let me change that real quick. Let's see, what would be good for him? 85? Sure. Alright, so. A little bit of downgrade tight end, but get some draft picks. I mean, Irv Smith, he didn't really impress me that first week anyway. But look at this, how many draft picks we have for 2026. Look at this. If you, if you don't think I'm going to trade something here, you crazy. Because we got all the fucking draft picks. All of them. Speaking of, let's take a look at the, at the uh, trading block. See what's around the league currently. I press on one. Okay, I'm not interested in quarterback, and this is really just a bad group here. <laughs> I want to take a look at corners. Who is a good corner available? Clark Phillips. Who he's killed Farley, Christian Benford. Hmm. Nick Needham, Michaela Evans. Hmm. Two years from Marco Wilson? He's skin fit. I'm in, I'm intrigued. I'm intrigued. Receivers, there's a like a assortment of guys. All right, I want to know what would the Titans want for him? Okay, so Marco Wilson. I'm just going to go over to the trade finder to make it easier. Actually, hold up. You have a lot of good... Hold up. Why not shoot about my weight class out here a little bit? Let's see a look around the league. Let's see if anyone has, like, a guy that we like to get rid of. Hmm. No, Denver's not going to trade me anybody. I wonder. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna look. See what they want. They don't. They're like, no. Fuck you. <laughs> okay. All right. I just want to see what they would say. Carlton Davis. Mm. 
No, they're saying fuck you too. Okay. No, I don't want nobody there. I'm not going to trade with the division players. Like Jackson, Byron Jones. No. Nope. Nope. Damn. This Eagle secondary is taking a hit. <laughs> James Bradbury is number one now. <laughs> I just got to see. No. Okay, tell me to go F myself too. Uh, I mean, Dory Jackson, he's an option. Dante Banks? Oh, I forgot. Okay. Which reunite your coin bench, Deontay Banks? I'm not against it. But what do you need that I can offer you? Because I don't believe I have much I can really offer you here. Besides some draft picks. I'm not going to overpay for them, too. So we're going to go a fifth and we'll work away from there, right? So you have like no interest just for a fifth. That is fine. I didn't expect that to work. What's his overall? E2. Okay, so he's good. How about one of my seconds? A fifth and a sixth. I'm going to try and get, get another pick out of this, too. How about a next year six? Close, but no cigar. Okay. So get rid of that, I guess. All right. Oh, they're like so close. Uh, I want to offer more picks though. All right, you know what? We'll go with my earlier six. Oh, they're like right there. Be like, oh, they're like right fucking there. Okay, so when one fifty one didn't work for the fifth. How about my one twenty nine? Will that work? Ah, uh, looks. Mm. So 161 didn't work. That's my earliest six. So how about that? I'll give you a seventh. One of my sevenths. But, 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 but. I want you next year's seventh. Boom. We got Dante Banks. Let's go. All right, and we gotta send someone away. I'm gonna cut Damian Harris. We're gonna carry three running backs this season. Actually, can I get anything for him? I doubt it. He's like very, yeah, nothing. Nobody cares about Damian Harris. Sorry, Damian. But boom, now we have Deontay Banks in the house. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, he's all about his scheme fit. He likes Nevada. Like, he's all about being here. He loves it. You're getting a new number, though. You're not going to be... You're getting a new number. Dante Banks, I officially award you with number... Hmm. I want to give him 24 just yet. That is a very special number for Raider fans. You know, you'll get number one. All right, so now we have both the Maryland cornerbacks from a couple years ago, Coin Ben and Deontay Banks. I'm so happy we got Deontay Banks now. Hopefully, he's our number one guy. We can go into you know the season with him and be fine. All right. Hold up. All right, so cornerbacks now. I got to organize this shit. <laughs> No, Nate Hobbs is the slot guy. All right, and our cornerback over here. You know, Denver Harris take the two snaps. Bennett, you've been struggling very bad this season, man. You have. Like, Ben has just not been good. I wish he'd been better, but he just hasn't been. I haven't seen really make a play this season, which is hard for me to say. 
All right, but thank you, Trump. I appreciate it. I'll see you guys next time. Maybe tonight. Have a good day, everybody.